Layla. No, wait, wait, wait! Stop! We first saw this frightening moment a couple of weeks ago. A mom catches a driver on her phone blowing past a school bus stop sign just as her daughter is about to cross the street. A lot of you very upset at the possibility the person would never be found. But today, police say they arrested the driver. Stephanie Whitfield joins us live with how they tracked him down. Steph. Yeah, guys, this really shows the power of social media. That mom had her phone out that afternoon to record video of her daughter getting back from the first day of kindergarten, and she definitely didn't expect what happened next. As you just saw, Josephine Kirk Taylor caught a driver ignoring the school bus's extended stop sign, narrowly missing her five-year-old. She shared the video online and with the media, and Police Chief Art Acevedo said today KHOU's tweet caught his attention, and he made sure his officers got to the bottom of it. Well, yesterday, 18-year-old Julio Correas was arrested and charged with reckless driving. I want to give thanks for the people who don't even know me, and they shared this video so that my daughter could receive justice. According to court documents, Correas told police, I saw the bus stopping and I was accelerating. That was my mistake. Now law enforcement is intentionally making an example of him because they hope next time someone pulls up to a stopped school bus when they're in a hurry, maybe they'll think twice about it and stop. They also want people to know that undercover officers have been following school buses around. They've also been hanging out in school zones, and they say just in the first week of school, they issued over a thousand citations just in the city of Houston. Guys. Wow, this is certainly certainly an example for all of us drivers. Thank you so much, Steph. Big moment here. A driver speeds past a stopped school bus, nearly hitting a child that was getting off. Yeah, this whole thing was actually recorded on the cell phone of that little girl's mother. Today, ABC 13's Micah Hatfield spoke with her about that terrifying moment. Micah? Hey, this story that we're doing today could have been completely different if this little girl had taken one more step towards the center line of this busy road. She could have been hit by a car as her mother stood by and watched. There goes Melina. Josephine Kirk Taylor and two of her children were waiting outside, excited for their sister Melina's special moment, finishing her first round trip to and from kindergarten on the bus. Me recording a special moment and a special moment and then it turned completely around. Notice the bus stops, puts out its stop sign. The kindergartner gets off the bus, ready to cross the road to her mom. This one car just continued to speed down the road and almost Layla. hit my daughter. No, wait, wait, wait. If she didn't listen. This whole incident could have been a, on a further step. The car never stopped, in fact. Fortunately, Melina was okay. You could have murdered a child. The mother hopes what almost happened to her daughter is a wake-up call for all drivers as children head back to school. It takes 10 seconds to stop so a child can cross the street. It takes 10, se 10 seconds for a child to get off the bus. The mother posted the video she took on Facebook, and hundreds of people are commenting, saying that this driver should be cited or charged. In fact, right after it happened, the mother did call Houston police, but they told her that they couldn't do anything, even though she caught the license plate number in her video. I'll tell you why coming up at 6 o'clock. Live in East Houston, Micah Hatfield, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. Major development this morning in a case where a driver blows right through a bus stop sign, almost hitting a child who was getting off the bus at the time. Now video taken of that incident, now gone viral, making national news. And now that driver is facing charges. He is 18-year-old Julio Correa, as you see him here. Channel 2's Vincent Curvelli was there this morning at a news conference where Houston's police chief thanked the public for keeping the story alive until they were able to track down that person they say is responsible. Vincent, good morning. Good morning. The police chief hopes this arrest will spread awareness to drivers to keep our children safe at the bus stop. No, wait, wait, wait. Stop! This is the terrifying viral video that captured our community's attention. Our children's lives are at stake when they're getting off the bus. A child's first day at school almost ended in tragedy. A driver made the conscious decision to disregard the lights the flashing lights and the stop sign that says stop when this little girl was being delivered to her mom. Houston Police Chief Art Acevedo says yesterday officers arrested 18-year-old Julio Correas and charged him with reckless driving, a Class B misdemeanor. That young man came within inches, if not a, a few feet, 
of going to prison for a long, long time. Mother Josephine Kirk Taylor is proudly filming her five-year-old daughter getting off the school bus after her first day of school. Moments later, investigators say Correa's ignored the bus's flashing lights and stop sign and almost hit Kirk Taylor's daughter. I really hope that we as a community can pay attention and protect our children by following the traffic laws so that this doesn't keep reoccurring. Chief Acevedo says that unmarked police cars are following school buses and pulling over violators. We are going to find you. We're going to charge you. We're going to put you in jail and we're going to prosecute you to the fullest extent of the law. But I hope this is a lesson for all reckless drivers to just stop and just let the children cross the street. And Correa's could face up to six months in jail. He had a $100 bond, which he posted. Reporting live downtown, Vincent Crivelli, KPRC, Channel 2 News.